I've now started this video over three times. So I'm in a little bit of a rush because I have to leave for my family Christmas Eve gathering in like 45 minutes at the latest. So I'm just gonna do um, a quick little holiday makeup routine sort of type deal. And by that, I mean my normal makeup routine but with red lipstick. So <laughs> that's pretty much all I'm doing. And weirdly enough, I get requests for my makeup routine all the time, which makes no sense to me because I don't do anything with my makeup. It's literally the most basic you can get, but whatever, we're doing it. So I'm gonna start out with my face primer. I use the Baby Skin with Mate from Maybelline. Maybelline Baby Skin Instant Pore Eraser. And I was amongst those people who kind of thought that primer was like a nonsense kind of thing. But I used it anyway just because it makes my makeup go on. Like it feels like smoother and not so, I don't know, aggressive. <laughs> like dry, I think, because I have really dry skin. So um, primer always makes it just feel like a little bit like extra not moisturized, but just like smooth or something. I don't know. Um, but I didn't really think it did anything. But then I put on my makeup without this the other day. And it was v like visibly noticeable that my pores were like so much more visible than they usually are. And I just thought I was kind of using it just because it made my skin feel better. But like literally this makes a huge difference. So... Like, this one I highly, highly, highly recommend. I think it's so nice. Um, okay. Primer on. Usually in the morning I would put my primer on and then brush my teeth. So that my primer could like really sink in. But, you know what, I don't have the time for that today. So, we're just going for it. Okay. And then I use <laughs> any kind of foundation. Here's my thing, I am so cheap and I don't care about makeup and I don't spend a lot of money on it. So all of my things are like, so anything I own is like hitting pan or old and I don't use it, or I don't use it for like the brand, I only use it because it's what's there. So this is pretty sure my mom's old foundation. It's literally this like old crusted, dusted <laughs> foundation. Like I don't know if you can see it, but like it's literally, clear and it's like all gone <laughs> so I just literally put it on my hands like a little dab of it on my hands and I'm so high tech I literally just rub it on there <laughs> I know I'm <laughs> like I could just it's just not something that's super important to me I have like a little mirror down here so that I can really see things and not just be looking in the camera. Just rub that in nice and good. Usually find the closest towel or washcloth and wipe my fingers on it. But guess what, don't have that. So my pants just kind of did the job, but I didn't actually wipe it on there. Okay, and then this is the my one splurge item that I use in my makeup, which is Tarte Shape Tape which mm, you guys know what this looks like, so I don't even need to do this. But um, I use this purely for the fact that my under eye bags are the part of my face that I struggle with the most to cover because they're just, I've had them forever. Um, so I literally just take these and I like hardly use any of this, so it lasts me forever. Um, so I just do three little dots underneath my eye some down here do, 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 do. and that's pretty much it <laughs> um okay and then I literally just take my finger and dab it with my finger I went through a phase where I was like really into beauty blenders and stuff but it's like, I just have to clean those things constantly or they get disgusting. And it's like, I have perfectly good fingers to do the trick. I don't feel like wasting all that time and effort cleaning because knowing me, I won't clean it. So <laughs> there we go. Um, I 
Okay. And then I just kind of brush it onto my eyelids so that I can just get like a little bit of different base of color and something for the eyeshadow that I hardly use to stick onto. Um, just brush it across my nose, have a little, just brush it across my nose, get it on my chin. <laughs> kind of brush it anywhere. Ooh, this is like a magnifying, so it looks so spooky on the back. Okay. Get it underneath my nose right there. And there we go. That's pretty much my face. <clears throat> okay, and then I don't use a setting powder <laughs> I just use like I think this is just like a foundation oh it's a pressed powder so I think it's just like foundation kind of powder but I just use it and cover up everything on my face I really don't do well <laughs> don't do I, I mean like I literally can't explain how little I do with my makeup like I just don't know how to do it in an effective way or like a creative way Got a little eye crusty in there still. Okay. Guys, I literally cannot believe it's Christmas. Oh, and for this, I just used like the Maybelline Fit Me pressed powder kind of thing. Um, and literally, this is what all of my beauty products look like. Everything hits pan every time. <laughs> like there was that little phase going around for a little bit that was like encouraging people like to hit pan on their beauty products. And I'm like, is that not a thing that everyone does? Like, literally, look at my blush. Like, hello? <laughs> I use these until there's, like, nothing left in it. I'm not buying anymore. Whatever. Um, okay, so then for then I do my blush next. Um, I literally use L'Oreal True Match just because it's there. And, yes, I use the same brush for my powder and <laughs> my blush. Um, and this is just the elf powder brush so hooray there um okay so i literally just put my blush on like that nothing exciting at all put a little on the neck <laughs> there we go we're feeling Rosie, my friends. Oh, I see little Mickey out of my window. Is Mickey back outside? He's not come back in yet. No. <laughs> I just saw him walking around. My out there. Okay. Then, new addition to my makeup routine. I do actually use highlighter. And I just rather have a lot of Maybelline products, which is weird. I don't intentionally buy lots of the same product. Um, but this one is their Maybelline Master Chrome. And I've actually seen like some people use these on videos and stuff. Um, I think they work really well. But as you can see, mine is absolutely destroyed. <laughs> so love that. Um, and I do have this brush. So I just recently started doing like the little Ipsy monthly subscription thing for makeup stuff and I got this brush in there so I feel kind of fancy so I use this for highlighter it's called glow it's a glow brush so I'm assuming that means highlighter I don't really know so I just tap that in there and then just rub it along the sides of my cheekbones this I probably need my own mirror for because I can't see yeah just rub it along the cheekbones 
back there a little. And then the other side. I don't know if you can actually see this on camera, but it makes a really pretty little glow. Oh yeah, you can see it. And then I just do like a doop, doop, doop on my nose. And sometimes if I'm feeling bold, I'll do it on my little Cupid's bow thingy. And then that's it. Just a little, little glowier. And then just recently, which is kind of fun, um, usually I use, again, Maybelline. I have a lot of Maybelline products, not intentionally at all. Um, I just use like this little teeny, teeny, tiny eyeshadow, again, which has hit pan already. Um, and I literally just go like, take my finger, rub it on there, and then do like do, 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 dot across that. Simple as pie. Um, but just recently I got this little ColourPop um, they give it to me straight palette because it was on sale for $12. And I was like, why not try it out? Um, and it has all these really pretty, like rosy kind of colors in them. Um, a hundred percent of them, which I will not use a lot of the time, but I really like some of the colors. So I'm just going to take this, like, I don't even know what you call it. It's basically just like beige matte color. And I'm just going to do all of this with my fingertips because I don't care. And I'm just going to brush that all over everything. Like, it's embarrassing how much I don't care about makeup. I think I, I think it's like a fun, like, creative thing to do if you're, like, good at it and enjoy it. But I just don't have the effort or the patience to do it. And I will, I just will not spend like 30 minutes in the morning doing my makeup. Like that's just a, that's just a no-go for me. Okay, so I just put that matte eyelid color basically on um, my eyelids. But then I'm going to take that like the glittery color that's like right beside it. Really pretty. You, <laughs> you can't see it, but it's there. Um. And I'm just going to dab that on my eyelids. Just to give us a little, little shimmer for the holiday season. Which I literally cannot believe it's Christmas Eve already. Okay. Just dab some of that in the inner corner as well, because you know, why not? Um, and there we go. That is my eyeshadow complete. Um, eyeshadow is probably the thing I know how to do the least, so that's awesome. Um, I don't usually put on eyeliner. If I do, I just use like the e.l.f. liquid liner. You can't see it again. There we go. Just e.l.f liquid liner i don't like liner sticks i like liquid liner um but i'm not gonna put that on today because i don't feel like it and then um for my mascara i've been using this one recently is it maybelline oh my god <laughs> maybelline should have just sponsored this video honestly um so this one is the it's not focusing maybelline total temptation mascara and I actually really kind of fell in love with this mascara. I'm like, have nothing left in mind, but I've just been reusing it over and over and over again. Um, but it has like, it has coconut oil in it and it smells incredible. And I just feel like it goes on really well and doesn't clump up. Um, so I just like it a lot. Uh, but I'm really running out of it right now, so... <laughs> Um, I do like one layer of this and then one layer of another kind. Um, I just think it makes your lashes look really pretty. Like, look at that. Hello? It's just like one little pass over it. Have something in my eye. Okay, so I just do a quick little pass of that. And then I have the... 
I'm pretty sure this is like, I don't know who it is. Luminous Million Lashes. I want to say this is the Carbon Black Mascara. I don't know who that's from. Um, I don't know who does that. At this point, it's probably Maybelline. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I like it. I like it quite a bit. It really elongates your lashes, which I feel like a lot of things don't do without making them just look like little sticks and look really twiggy looking. But I feel like the combo of these two work actually really well with each other. See, look at that. Boom! Okay. Sorry this is literally so boring. Like, I don't know how to talk and do this at the same time. And it's literally taken me, like, double the amount of time than it usually does to do my makeup because I'm trying to talk. Like, usually this takes me, like, 15 minutes. Okay, so I'm just going to do a little bit underneath my lashes. Just for some boom effect, you know? And I feel like I've been out of focus this whole time. Um, so, yeah, that's pretty much it <laughs> for my makeup. And then today, um, this came in my little ipsy thing, um, this red lipstick. So I'm going to put this on. Am I going to regret it? Maybe, because I've never tried it before. So, i got to put my chapstick on. I always put on chapstick before I put on lip, uh, lipstick, because I hate the way it feels, like, all dry and stuff. So, we'll see. Okay, this is very red lipstick. Let's see. We're going to try it. Oh, and this is, so this came in my little Ipsy container, but it's, Please don't tell me they have a hashtag in their name. Yep, hashtag INM, INM Cosmetics. I don't know. It's called Frozen Lipstick and it's red. I don't know what that means, but. It smells like mint. Oh, that's a look. Okay. I really can't talk during this because I will get this everywhere. This actually feels really good. It's like super buttery and it has like I don't, you can like see it it has like golden flakes on the outside it has like golden flakes on the outside and then the inside is red also I have the nastiest crustiest old lady hands so don't mind that um okay it's very very red you know, it'll do for the time being. So yeah, that's my makeup look for the day. Fun and festive. Um, but then I have my, from Great Adventure Supply Co on Instagram. You can find them there, Great Adventure Supply Co. They have this shirt, which is literally the scene from Mean Girls and I'm obsessed with it. So I had to buy it. I love it so much. Um, so go check them out on Instagram. They're wonderful. And they literally hand delivered this to me when I was in Florida. I was trying to get it before the party, but they couldn't get it to me before. But they literally delivered it to my hotel so that I could have it for my trip. So they're they're literally incredible. So go check them out. I'm obsessed with this. So this is the final makeup look. <laughs> very low-key, very easy, very um, not makeup savvy. So that's it for me. Merry, merry, merry Christmas Eve. I will see you all tomorrow for the last day of Vlogmas, which I can't believe. But... Yeah, so excited. Merry Christmas. Enjoy tonight. Get some sleep so Santa can come visit you. And then a fun little Christmas surprise. Merry Christmas. Oh, we oh, lost this little Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Merry Christmas from our little Santa Pop. <laughs> <laughs> Look at it. <laughs> he has a little Santa socks on. And
in his little gingerbread outfit. And he's so happy. He's not grumbling though. No, no, when I got him dressed, he was fine. <laughs> now he can't see. <laughs> there we go. Merry Christmas! Say <laughs> Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas, buddy! You're so cute. <laughs> so we're having a very Merry Christmas here, if you can tell. <laughs> Yay! Okay, that's it. Merry Christmas. Merry Bye. Christmas! <laughs>